People often think here at Growing Spaces that we don't deal with aphids, but we definitely do. And even though we have lots of articles and videos talking about how to deal with pests, my favorite is employing ladybugs. So the best time to release ladybugs is going to be dusk or dawn in that cool period of the day. Um, right now our 42 isn't as well established with shade, so it was really important to put them in in the evening time. So if you're just starting a new dome like we just did in the 42, we're still establishing a habitat, so we're really wanting to encourage the ladybugs to stay. So we're utilizing screen doors. Um, putting them near plants that are already covered in aphids so they have food to eat and then hopefully they'll start breeding and producing larvae which is going to help take care of the bulk of the aphids. Our 42 foot dome is roughly about 1400 square feet so they recommend about 1500 ladybugs per 1000 square feet. I believe I put in about 3000 because I knew some would fly away since it's new and not established. Uh, they will start to breed, so that should fill up. And you can order ladybugs pretty much on any online gardening outlet. And I found that they can store in the fridge for up to two weeks. So that'll give you a little bit of time to get them out at the perfect time, get established in your garden so they have something to eat. And super fun fact is ladybugs can eat up to 5,000 aphids in their lifetime, which is super awesome for us gardeners. So. If for all your other pests, feel free to check out our resources online as well.